Steve back for it now for Martin. Back for Steve. Around back behind for Hamlin. Hamlin ahead. Far side pass for Meyer. Kicks it free, and I believe Sinclair was in the, ended up a little bit in their favor. They need to take advantage here and uh, get this early goal. A couple of shots there on that power play ultimately for AIC, but Ladd was equal to both of them, and then the, the penalty kill settled in there nicely. Puck back in the Kanisha zone one more time. Pass back behind the goal there from Matt Long is deflected, but picked up here by Melaragni. Off the boards, backhand pass taken here by Lambert. Numbers here for Canisius. Three on two. Everyone joining the play now as that shot's fired on by Lambert and sticked away by Durante. Stella back behind the goal. Hounded there by Long. Long gets it back, trying to work his way to the side of the goal. That puck is going to be pinned there but between a pad and some netting. They are letting this play go for a bit. And Meyer, Lapide in front through the blue paint. Nobody home. Bouncing puck comes back to neutralize. And Kyle Steffen finds Dodaro all by himself. And a teammate with him. And it's lifted up over the goal by Maver. A 2 on 0 basically there for Dodaro. And Maver not able to put it on Ladd. Hutchison back the other way. Down below the goal line here for Meyer. Meyer, a chip puck. Played high in the air. Meyer still chasing after it. Back behind the goal for Hutchison. Try to wrap that one in front. Meyer gets it up top here for Lambert. Let's one go to foot to play in front. Hutchison got it. And then Meyer scooper for, for four minutes in a six-minute segment without him. He's out there now playing with, back with Miata where he, he's played a lot so far this season. Yeah. Just over two minutes remaining here in the first period as AIC plays it back into the Canisius zone. Lambert around for J.D. Poe. Knocked away from him. Kept in. Down the wall. That one fired off the side of the cage, takes an odd angle bounce, and comes back to neutralize, where it's taken down here now by Kapchak. Across for DeMel. Off the stick of Lambert, back in behind the goal. J.D. Pogue. Back behind for Lambert. Played up the boards here now. Opsuit the head towards Sinclair, a little bit out of his reach, deflected back in by Bariga. Bariga charging after it. He and Lambert fighting forward in the corner. Gets it back towards Maver, now up top for Luca. Trying to elude a check there from Pogue. And Pogue is all over him. They both go down. The Out here for him in the second period is the Golden Griffin strike first. And for the freshman from Powell River, British Columbia, his second goal of the weekend and his eighth of his freshman season. And Hoover one point closer to that big 100. 95th career point for the captain Hoover. Casey Jerry, another senior, will carry that puck into the AIC zone here on senior afternoon into early evening now in downtown Buffalo, New York, as that puck pops up into game for Casey Jerry in the blue and gold. It's a workhorse. Back behind the AIC goal, Durancey plays it around on the far side. Kept in at the blue line by Lambert, who lets one go, and Durancey had to kick out the right leg on that one as Lambert let a cannon blast go from just inside the blue line. Elijah Bariga's shot is blocked high off the glass, picked back up by Canisius. Bouncing down for Meyer, Martan is able to get it out to neutral ice while getting taken down as well. Bariga overskated it, taken back by Lambert. Grant Meyer ahead now, inside the blue line, throws it in behind the goal. Again, Durante there to play it off the glass. Knocked down by Miato. Down low here for Martan. Pass back up top, but no one was there between the faceoff circles for Canisius, and it comes back the other way. Bariga at center ice will float this one. A high bouncing puck into the corner. Pike takes a whack at it. Goes back around on the far side. Jestro try to play ahead. He's tangled up over there with Coach. in today's game, so he's a man on fire today as well. AIC heads back to the power play now for the third time. They are 0 for 2. And Canisius back on the well now. Urgent care penalty kill. There's a good pass in the slot, and Reinhardt has his shot blocked. That was a play they scored on yesterday. Kyle Steffen has this pass intercepting him back to the blue line, but it's held in by Brennan Kapchak. Far side for Christensen. In the skates of Flatteby, he's forced to circle back with it up top for Kapchak. Kapchak. Christensen. Let's one go. That one changes directions. Came back in front and is chunked just wide by Steffen. And here comes Master Donato. Full head of steam the other way. He will chip it in, and he'll go off for a change. Worth noting, of course, for this top power play unit, Martin Melberg, who would normally be out there for the Yellow Jackets, was ejected, given a game misconduct for a boarding call early on in the first period. So Kyle Steffen has been out here with them now. Let's that puck go. Does Steffen for Reinhardt. Back up top for Kapchek. Vladimir. Kapchek. 
Christensen across for Flatterby. Tried to get a stick on it. Deflected just enough of it there by Jestro and Long. And it's thrown back down the ice by Matt Long. Fit Lad. Got away from him, but luckily for the Canisius goaltender, got away from him back behind the play and not into the back of the net. Stampahar across for Jestro. Obsu fighting through a check there from Revering. Still has it. Chips that one ahead. Knocked into the AIC zone there by Sinclair. Parker Revering backtracking forward ahead for Stefan. Pass ahead, away from everyone. Icing forthcoming here. A negative result on the scoreboard, but that being said, still half a hockey game almost yet to be played here. And Kadishas knows, and they saw what this team could do in the third period yesterday. This lead is far from safe. Dodero across the ice, away from Stefan. This is a bouncing puck in behind the play. Hamlin. Gets it back now from Hutchison. Tried to play a backhand pass, but it was knocked down by Kyle Steffen. Dodero. One hand on a stick bumped off the puck there by Hamlin. He's having himself a monster of a period. Gets it ahead for Master Donato, who's got Hoover with him, trying to go back. Yox will pick it up here now. Yox in front, deflected away from... That was Stella trying to work it free, and as Hoover trimmed better at them. This will be their fourth power play here of the afternoon. They are 0 for 3 to this point, but you feel like you can't keep giving them chances. And there's a fortuitous start to it there for Canisius. Spuck rolls right over the blade of the stick of Brennan Kapchuk out to neutralize. Flatterby, nice pass across, comes in front, and Stefan not able to get it to settle down. Back to the blue line, but kept in again by Kapchuk. Blake Christensen down towards the goal line. Below it now for Stefan, and they switch spots across for Flatterby. Kapchuk, one touch pass back for Christensen. Christensen takes a bump there from Master Donato, throws a pass across, Flatterby, shot on, save made by Ladd, puck bouncing in the air, is picked up by Melaragni and did a good job finding the room, taking his time there, and gets it back down the ice. Kanisha on, Kanisha's on the well now urgent care penalty kill, and a good start to it there in those first 45 seconds, and the freshman defenseman Melaragni continues to have himself a nice weekend. Pass on the far side, room for Reinhardt, and fires on, he scores! They haven't really generated any zone time since their own power play at the start of the period. Here's Kevin Opsuth back behind the goal now. Up a one defensive zone draw for Canisius. They have been the better team so far today, at least, in the faceoff circle. There's Kyle Steffen. That one's off the leg of Capcheck. Taken back ahead now. Nice pass ahead now for Sinclair. Sinclair will chip it ahead and go chasing after it. He and Demel fighting forward in the corner. Demel gets there first back behind the goal for Steffen. Stefan deep possessed by Opsuth, had his pocket picked. Opsuth and Poke ran into each other inside the blue line. That lets the puck come free, still fighting for it though is J.D. Poke. Backhand pass in front oh. for Sinclair! It got through the goaltender. His eighth of the season and his 29th in his AIC career. And just like that, what was looking like a, a huge period here for Canisius has gone by the wayside. Opsuth across center ice now. Opsuth into the zone. Opsuth still has it. His pass across is blocked about as high as you can physically. Wallace comes off the stick of Christensen and back to center ice. Stampahar lays one back ahead for Meyer. Carries it right back in. Meyer takes a bump there from Revering. Still has it. Bounce pass there for Long. Off the stick of Jerry behind the goal. And Revering one more time will collect. And now Elijah Bariga carries it free. And fires it back into the Canisius, and as both teams finish their changes, Bariga tangled up, taken down behind the play. Penalty coming up here to Canisius. The AIC used the power play well in the third period yesterday to salt that game away. They will try to do so again here. Early on in the third period, as Flatterby holds that puck in and fires a shot. Goes wide off the glass, off the back of the netting. Kept alive here now by Blake Christensen. Christensen's pass deflects off the back of Hoover, but kept in here by Kyle Steffen. Across for Kapchek. Kapchek. Christensen, blue line, shot goes wide, bouncing puck back to the slot. Kapchek takes the shot, lets the second one go. Deflected just wide, wraparound chance from Reinhardt. And a pad save made there by Ladd. Christensen across for Flatteby. Kapchek winds it, fires one off the goalpost. Might have changed directions in front. Christensen back down low for Stefan. Yellow Jackets all over Canisius here. Still a minute 10 remaining in the power play. Christensen takes a bump, goes down to a knee, keeps the play alive here for Stefan. Stefan. Capcheck. Backhand pass for Stefan. Let's one go. Save made. Rebound there in front. And Ladd able to cover. Luca carried free now. Handle. Puck taken right back here by the Yellow Jackets. Stefan. 
who runs into Hutchison, who knocked him off the puck, but unfortunately both of them lost it, and AIC is able to fire it back into the Canisius end. Here's Keaton Master and I don't know, charging after it back into the AIC end. Hutchison on the boards, fighting for it. Puck is flung sky high and settles down in center ice here where Derek Hamill will play off a skate, and it's collected here by Bariga. Bariga back in, lets one go. That is down here by Sinclair. Across for Steve, who will take it out of his own end now. Matt Steve makes a move at center ice, still has it, lets one go, and a low glove save made there. But Bariga wins it back, but it's kept in here by Hoover, shot from a tough angle, shouldered away by Durante. In behind the goal. Hoover and Luca tangle up. Master Donato trying to force his way in there as well. Three defenders surrounding the two Canisius forwards, and yet the numbers game doesn't add up for the first bit. But Hoover came out from the corner, lost the handle, and right back the other way now comes Luca Maver. Bouncing puck is sticked away from the front of goal there by Ladd. Back to the blue line. Demelja kicked away in front. It came back off the stick of Stefan. And it's turned back the other way now by Hutchison. It's a foot race. Demel is there. He's going to beat Master Donato to it. Goes hard behind his own goal. Ahead here now near side for Bariga. Played for Maver, who is off. Body into Christensen a little bit late there. Here comes Nick Hutchison with it. Now Hutchison trying to get a backhand and a great job there by Baum getting the stick on there as Hutchison tried to wheel back to his forehand in tight. Hutchison in the corner with it now. Hutchison back down low in the boards. Playing up here and trying to get it to Master Donato, but out of his reach and taken back by Maver. Kyle Steffen, pressure there by Master Donato. Maver takes a hit from Master Donato, and both of them go hard into the boards right in front of the Canisius bench. The pass from AIC is a pass to nowhere, and I think Master Donato might be getting called here for a penalty at the end of that. Referee's arm is up behind the play in just this lead with 7-16 remaining in the third. We've seen the Canisius penalty kill come up big in important times, but they're going to need to generate a goal here. Cap check across for Christensen. Christensen works it down the zone behind the Canisius goal now with it. Vladeby. Vladeby inside. Reinhardt lets one go as he got dumped to the ice there by Hoover. And that fires up the Canisius bench. Reinhardt's shot went wide. It's picked up by Stampahar and thrown down the ice. And the captain, Matt Hoover, out there trying to set the tone here for this penalty kill with that hit. Carried back out here by Capcheck. Cap check will chip it into the corner. Takes a bump on his way by. Lambert will let a hard puck go around the boards. It gets away from Christensen. And here comes Miato. It's a two-on-two. Two. He's got Long with him. Long in front. And a low pad save made there by Durante. Kind of ran out of real estate there a little bit. It was a really good night for the freshman forward. Getting a goal. Second goal of the weekend. Getting to play on the top line. You just can't do that. Back in live action here now as the puck is thrown right down the ice by Steve off that one faceoff. And Christensen now. In the near side corner, we'll pick it up. Christensen ahead for Reinhardt. Into the Canisius zone, swept away by Stephen. Right back down the ice it goes. Just now three minutes remaining in the major power play here for AIC. And the, the tough part is for Canisius, even if you successfully kill this off, it eats up so much of the latter part of this game here now. There will be just over two minutes remaining when this penalty expires. Back to the blue line, held in here by Christensen. Juggled it for a second, got it back, and took a huge shot there from Miato. Comes back behind the goal. Stampahar will settle it down, and he will wing it off the glove of Christensen and back to the AIC zone. Cap check ahead here now. Cap check. Backhand off the boards. Taken back behind. Stefan. Cap check. Christensen. Back for Stefan, turns that pass across, it's there for Flatteby, and a save made by Ladd, who had to come across quickly as the puck just got away from the defender. There's another big hit there, freeing the puck up for Hoover. Had it in the skates for a second, but couldn't settle it down. Kept in by Flatteby, trying to work his way in front, save made by Ladd. Puck comes back to the corner, and is thrown down the ice by David Melaragni. Under two remaining in the major power play, 4-11 remaining in the third period for the Yellow Jackets. Reinhardt, back for Christensen, for DeMel. Christensen, bank pass back up top for DeMel. Across, cap check. DeMel lets it go. That one's blocked by Miato and comes back to neutralize. Cap check with 17 seconds left in the power play. Skates it out of his zone end. Cap check. 
Makes one move. That one came off of Hutchison. Backhand pass ahead. Out to neutralize. Martin is standing. Five seconds left. Carried in by Reinhardt. Reinhardt takes a bump. Hamlin goes down to the ice. Hoover ahead for Hutchison. And Martin is back on the ice. Kanisha survives. But now they have to find some offense here. With just over two minutes to go. Still trailing by a goal. 2.05 remaining as Hamlin goes back and picks it up. Lad is signaling to the bench. Wondering.